right, hello Unboxing Brook community. Today we are going to have a new themed opening. So that means we are going to do a ton of Unified Minds booster packs, a few of these uh, blister packs, I forgot what they were called for a moment, these ones you get when you're right at the cash register, and just for kicks and giggles we are going to do Shining Legends Mewtwo Pit and Box. So today we are looking for Mew. We are searching for Mew and Mewtwo. Uh, we're searching for the GXs, we're searching for the Rare, we're searching for all the cards you're looking for in Unified Minds and Shining Legends. I hope we get some good pulls today, but first I need to open everything up. But before I do that, I am interested. I'm going to put a few booster packs aside because I noticed if you see on Unified Minds, you see that they cut the corners off. For some reason, I got some pack, uh, booster packs that they didn't cut the corners off. And just for fun, I want to see if that makes a difference. I doubt it does, but I think it'd be fun just to see. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put these to the side to know that they're the ones that didn't have the corners cut off. I thought maybe it was just an art, like maybe one artwork did that, but I found the same exact pack art with the corners cut off, so that wasn't true. So we'll see uh, what comes of that. But first, I gotta open all of them up to save some time. So give me a moment and I'm gonna open everything and then we'll get started. All right, everyone, I am done. I've opened everything up, including the Shining Legends pin collection box. I didn't decide to open it uh, in front of you on the camera because I've done it in an episode before. If you wanna see that box open piece by piece as well as the Marshadow and Pikachu box, go check out the episode on Shining Legends and you can see that. Now, as a reminder, I want to remind all of you guys the cards that we are looking for. In Unified Minds, we are looking for Espeon and Deoxys, Misty's Favor, and Blue Tactic. Those are the ones that I personally really want, along with the ones that everyone wants. But uh, we are also looking out for the Viridian Forest Secret Rare, Mewtwo and Mew, the Secret Rare as well, the Cherish Ball, the Cherish Ball Secret Rare, Raichu and Alolan Raichu, uh, Raichu and Alolan Raichu Secret Rare, and the Reset Stamp Secret Rare. That's a lot, but that's what we're looking for there. We're also looking for Shiny Legends, all of the Shiny Pokemon, the Mewtwo GX, Full Art Secret Rare, and the Secret Shiny, and the Raichu GX Secret Rare. Those are all the cards that we are looking for today. Hopefully, we pull one. I'm keeping everything crossed. I hope that we pull something from either set. Also want to remind you guys, we have a giveaway going on for this binder right here. All you have to do is go to the last episode, like the episode, subscribe to the channel, and as long as we have 10 people who have done that, I can pull a name from a hat. That's just to make it fair. It's a random number I chose, but 10 people. I'll pull your name. If I pull your name, I'll let you know on this channel in the next episode. I'll also let you know on my Instagram, Unboxing Broke. It might be 23. Unboxing Broke. I'll, I'll put it in the link on this description. Uh, check on that too. I'll also announce if we have a winner on there. Then what I'm going to do is put your name in the comments of my next video. All you have to do is reply to that and then we can get you started from there as to how to get the binder. Reminder again, this is what you can have. If you All you have to do is just tell me what's your favorite starter Pokemon, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and that could be yours. Um, if you are a minor, make sure that your parent or guardian is the one that's doing all of this. That's to make sure that you have asked for their permission. Make sure that whenever you do anything on YouTube, to ask for your parents' permission if you are under 18. Alright, now that we've got that out of the way, let's get into the Unified Minds. I'm really excited. I wish I had Hidden Fates for you guys, but honestly I cannot find it anywhere in my area. Um, so hopefully one day soon i'll have something for that i'm gonna get all the promos and the code cards away so you guys know these are the ones in the three blister packs that we got we got the uh stack attack ultra beast promo uh let me make sure the camera is there we go in focus we got the vicavolt promo which i like them both uh here's the code card for stack attack here's the one for the vicavolt here are the coins they're both the same. It's a Rowlet coin. It uh, looks pretty cool. I actually really like coins. Um, though after watching the Pokemon World Championships, I realized why you really like dice instead of coins to play with. And by you, I mean most people who play prefer to play with die as opposed to coins. And now I kind of think I prefer that too. Uh, these are the promos and code cards from the 
ones you buy right at the cash register, they're usually right there uh, to get you a last minute to get it. You have the Pikachu promo. I always love Pikachu, whether it's a promo or in the set. I don't care. I'll take it. And then you got Sudowoodoo promo as well. Also, uh, love Sudowoodoo. Um, sorry, I was making sure the camera was still recording. We had some issues last episode. Uh, we have this coin as well. They're both the same. So you have those, which uh, are pretty. Uh, blue is my favorite color, so I enjoy that. But, um, no, I don't remember. I don't know why I said but. My apologies. Here's the code card for Pikachu. Here's the code card for Sudowoodoo. Oh, that's what I was going to say. I really liked when the game introduced Sudowoodoo. Uh, when it was just this thing blocking your path and you had to figure out how to get it out of your way. I'm trying to figure, you know what, I'll get this out of the way. This is part of the Ping collection box. It's a Mewtwo promo. I love that one as well. And here's the code card. Um, I'm not really sure which one I want to start first. I do like that we have uh, the Shining Genesect as our pack art. Um, let's start with a Unified Mind. I'm a little worried about some of these packs. I got them from Walmart, but if you can see, some of them look like they're damaged already, and uh, that has me a little worried. Because um, I got them right off the shelf. I didn't get them anywhere special. Uh, so let's get into that one first. Let's get that out of the way, but it kind of looks like they're all like that, and that really has me um, concerned, because I bought them at separate times too, so I'm not sure what happened. Um, Let's see. Let's get into it. Since this one's ruined, I'm just going to rip it. I'm not going to save it. Uh, I don't know if you can see in the background, you might be able to see I have my new pack art wall set up. It has all the of my favorite arts from the packs. Um, so far, it looks like the cards are okay. So I'm glad. There's a code card for that. Uh, let's move that over there. All right, let's get into it, guys and gals. We have Leaf Energy, and Mega, Earringing Bell, Lane's Quiz Show, Onyx, Fletch, Einder, Snover, Murkrow, Execute. Oh, that's cool! It's a Psychic Execute. Type Null, Reverse, Hollow, and I think I see something fun. Let's see. I'm really glad now that the cards weren't damaged because it is. Yes, Omega Sableye and Tyranitar GX wasn't one of the ones I was looking for, but I'll still take it. It's amazing. It's beautiful. I love how it has the shimmer on it. I'm going to go get a sleeve for that. Leave today. It's just light blue sleeves. That's all it is. Um, so let's get a sleeve for that. Awesome pull. Our first pull. Great first pack magic. I wish the... Uh, pack wasn't as damaged as it was, but I'm glad that it was just the pack and not the cards. That is all I care about. Alright, so we're going to sleeve that up. Right there. If I can get it in there. Alright, uh, we're going to put them up here for our great pools. We're going to put the... This is getting busy. Let's turn these like this. Sorry, guys. There we go. Now you can see them all. Alright. So that was a pretty good first pack. Let me do a few more and then we'll get into a Shiny Legends. This one wasn't too badly damaged, but I have no idea what happened. Maybe how it was hanging on the shelf. Maybe it like got bent at the bottom. I, I'm not really sure. Um, but again, looks like the cards are okay. Here's the code card for that. Let me know if you get something fun out of that. I love code cards. But I want to make sure to give them all to you because you guys are amazing people. Remember, anytime you come to this channel, you are loved and accepted. Doesn't matter who you are. Doesn't matter if you like me. I don't care. I like you. All right. Let's get started with the Steel Energy, Grimsley, Yukimoku, Archon. These are really cool cards. Slack Off, Fungus. So I'm looking at it. I think that's fine. I think it was just like... Uh, shine off the, I, I don't know, I thought it was damaged. Glad it's not. Bone Edge, or I'll have to look into it, but I don't think it is. Magnemite, Fletchling, Marini, as a reverse rare, and Lipard, regular, ho uh, rare. Regular hollow. Regular rare. Um, which is okay, because we got a great pull on our first pack. Let's get into the next one, and then maybe we'll do a Shining Legends one. 
This is uh, Mew and Mewtwo. Uh, what's your theory? Do you think that if you have Mew and Mewtwo on the front of the pack that you'll get the GX? Or do you think that that means you won't get the GX? Some people think it means uh, that you will. Um, but if you have Mew and Mewtwo on the front, it's kind of like a foretelling that you're going to get it. Some people think that it means nothing. And some people think that, of course, they would not have the Mew and Mewtwo in that one. And therefore, you should avoid it. I don't know, to be honest. I think it'd be cool to pull the Mew and Mewtwo GX. Um from that pack, but I don't think, I don't know if it matters. Maybe we'll do an episode where we do all Mew and Mewtwo and see if we can get it out of those packs. Who knows? Uh, fighting Energy, Delmize, oh, I love that car. That's really cool, sorry. Because uh, you can see in the bottom here, you can see like Pioka Munku and Wishy Washy into his tail. Uh, so that's really cool. Heracross, Coach Trainer, Fungus. Okay, yeah, it's on the same card, so it's not damaged. Tone Edge, Sneasel, Magnemite, Slack Off. I would love to be a Slack Off right now, just chilling. Because uh, it is Sunday, so I wish it was a lazier Sunday than it's been, but it's been pretty lazy. I went to the Jonas Brothers concert last night in Hershey Park. It was absolutely phenomenal. If you happen to get your hands on tickets for that, do it. Uh, so today I've just kind of been resting because it was super late and it took forever to get out of the park. Uh, so I didn't get home till uh, close to two o'clock. So it has been a pretty lazy Sunday. So slack off lazy Sunday. It has been. This is an amazing reverse hollow grant. Giratina. I need to get better at saying that. Uh, and then for our rare, it's a regular rare. Un pheasant. Uh, okay. Yes, I said we do a shining legends next. Let's do the Mew one. I want to save that one. I don't know why. Something in me says save it. So let's do the new one, and it's okay if I ruin it, I already have the one on the back of my wall. Um, here's the code card, I like that the part is facing away from us so I don't have to spoil whether or not it's green or white. Uh, four for the back, here we go, lightning. Sorry, I got really thrown off because I was like, wait, that's not a unified minds energy, but then I realized we're not doing unified minds, we're doing shiny legends. Alright, soft please. Great Ball, Scrafty, Larvesta, Breloom, Toracat, Plusle, Zorora, or Zorua, Floatzel, and that's pretty cool. Hollow, Manamphy. I love the Hollows from Shining Legends. Um, I do think it's kind of weird how there's, I mean, I'm all for it, but there's way more Shinies in the new Hidden Fates than there is in Shining Legends. Which you think would be different because it's called Shining Legend, so you think it'd have a lot of shinies. But I'm not complaining. I'll take as many shinies as I can get in as many sets as I can get. I don't care. Put all the shinies in there. I'm not gonna complain. I just thought it was a little strange. Alright. Garchomp, are you gonna give us some pack magic? I hope so. I mean, so far, this is what we've got the uh, Mega Sableye and Tyranitar GX. Which I am not complaining, that is a cool pool, but I'm hoping to get the new 2 and new GX, Secret Rare, whatever we can get. If I can get this open. Alright, I've already ruined it. Let's go. Hey, the Lazy Sunday Slack Off. Alright, here's your code card. Got four, we'll see that Slack Off in four cards from now. We got Lightning, another Lightning, cool. Ear Ringing Bell, Blaine's Quiz Show. That's actually really cool. Uh, it reminds me of all the crazy Japanese shows where you, sometimes you game shows where you're not really sure what's going on. A rain guru. There's our lazy Sunday slack off. Fungus. Honedge. Magnemite. Fletchling. Drifloon. That is a beautiful card. Is our reverse rare and Latias. It is not hollow, regular rare, but that is okay. I actually think I'm gonna sleeve the Manafi just because why not? Um, I just really like it, so I'm gonna sleeve it up. Uh, I guess we can keep it up there by the. I'll put it over here because it's not quite ultra rare club worthy, but it's still pretty cool. So keep it to the right, and our Mango Sab Sable Eye and Tyranitor GX will stay there. I'm gonna do some more over here. Let's uh, get some more Guard Chomp. Hopefully this time they'll give us some pack magic. It's opened up a little better, so maybe that means something. Probably means nothing, but who knows. 
Aw, oh, man. We'll see, some people think it means nothing, so hopefully it means nothing. Here's the code card. Let me know again if you're getting anything cool out of that. I'd really love to know. Um, uh, yeah. I'd really like to know what you're getting out of those code cards. And let's go, water. My favorite energy, maybe that is, uh, or my favorite type and energy. So maybe that's a thing that will let us know that there's good stuff coming. Stadium nav, gabite, in a guard chomp, uh, pack. That's cool. Cherish ball. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm putting that in a. I was flying through that like there's nothing in there. Cherish ball. Surprisingly enough, it's still very valuable on its own because it's incredibly playable. Uh, I see. I saw it played a lot in the uh, worlds. So I'll put that over here. I am going to put that with St. Lie and Tyranitor GX, even though it's not an ultra rare. I'm going to do it anyway because it's one of the cards we wanted to pull, so we can check that off the list. All right, new mole. Dynamo. That's actually really cool how they uh, show you the bolt in Dynamo and they uh, accentuate that. That's a really cool. Oh, Bole, or Poi Pool. Wow. Ultra Beast, Snorunt, let me get this back in focus because I had it zoomed in, Jober, I reverse, Hollow is Met Metatite doing yoga, and Lipard, not Hollow, I believe, yep, that's our second one, um, is what it is, Let's see if I can, ah, whatever, it's still good, alright, let's go to our Mew and Mewtwo, will we get some pack magic because Mew and Mewtwo is in there? Let's see, maybe it is the GX pack. So, let's get to it. I'm going to, ah, uh, I saw the code again. Alright, here's the code card. Let's see what's going on in this pack. Yeah, sorry, it felt like I had shuffled it, so I wanted to make sure I didn't mess up the trick. Dark Energy. Lapras. I love that with Misty in the background and the rainbow. It's actually probably one of my favorites there. Relicant. Uh, Fracture. Pikachu. Yes. It looks like one happy Pikachu. Looks like it's going to get some donuts. Uh, Lickitung. Purloin. Looks like she's uh, stealing Pokeballs. Magmar from the Pokemon Snap. I actually pulled it out for you guys today. Let me make sure it's good looking. That's the game I was re referencing when I said this card looked like it came from Pokemon Snap. Uh, this is one of my favorite games playing or growing up to play. Uh, I still play it actually now. I got a Nintendo 64 right here. I play it all the time. Uh, so that's what this Magmar reminds me of the one that you took pictures of in that game. Dynamo, different version. Uh, Blizzard Town, Reverse Hollow, that's really cool, and then, here we go for our rare. Small Wild GX, that is a beautiful card, I am loving it. Um, that's amazing, I'm gonna sleeve that up before I forget. And it is going to join our Cherish Ball and Mega Sableye Tyranitar GX. Join the party, Mawile. Like, I don't know what is up with these sleeps. They're really hard to get the cards in. Um, so that's uh, no fun. Sorry, I'm checking to make sure the sleeves aren't bending the cards because that's a no-go. Let's get uh, our Mew pack going. See if we can get a Mew from Mewtwo from Shining Legends because that is the name of the game this episode. Finding you and you two. Let's hope we get it. All right, there's our Shining Legends code. Let's get the four cards from the back, put it in the front. We've got water, loving it. All right, Pokemon Catcher, Great Ball, Scrafty, Quillfish, looks like a Pufferfish, uh, Stunfisk, my favorite Bulbasaur, my favorite uh, Bulbasaur card, my favorite Pokemon is Squirtle Gallet. Voltorb, yes, Hollow Energy, and then a Hollow Latios. So I'm actually gonna sleep both of them because I like Hollow Energies. Not everyone sleeves them. I do. Why not? I've got the sleeves. I don't have to be uh, scarce with them. 
So put that, but I'm gonna put this over with Manaki because they're cool, but they're not ultra rare. So they get the sleeve, but they don't get to join the party or the family of ultra rares we have on the left here. All right. So far, we have gotten Hollow Manaki, Hollow Latios, Osa, Os, Latios, uh, Hollow Energy, and then for our Ultra Rare Party, we have a Cherish Ball, though it's not an Ultra Rare, it's actually uncommon, it's still worth a lot, and it's still a really playable, really cool card. We have Mawile GX, and we have Sableye, Tyranitar, Tag Team GX. So they can stay in that party. Let's hope we get more cards to join the party. Next up is the Espeon. So, well, Espeon, uh, Dark Rack, uh, Pack, but I kind of like Espeon better, so that's why I said Espeon. Sorry, Dark Rack. All right, you already saw. Here's the code card. Let's get four from the back. Let's get to it. We have Dark Energy. So far, Dark Energy has actually spelled great things for us. Heracross, Type Null, Steeny, Stunfisk, Gibble. I, once again, I probably said this before, I love the crochet cards. I crochet myself. I know how difficult it is to do that. So I enjoy it. Lick a tongue. Dwebble. That's really cool that it has small trace in the back. Muna. Crustal. For our reverse. And. A hollow hoopa all right so not too bad of luck but not an ultra rare but he can go and join the hollow party over to our right um, but not quite the ultra ultra rare fam on the left it's still a good pool all right let's go again with the new Mewtwo I would struggle to open these because I don't want to bend the cards um, let me get the code card back here. Here's the code. And then for... Did I skip one? Nope, just felt like a fifth card. Alright. We got Fighting. Type Null again. Pokemaniac. Lapras. Snover. Puccini. Fungus. Hone Edge. Sneasel. Our Reverse Hollow is Salazzle. And our rare is a non-hollow Amoongus. Um, that's weird. I got like some sticky stuff from the cards on my nail. Whatever. Hopefully it'll be good luck. It means that all the ultra rares are gonna stick to us. Hopefully. All right. Here's another Espeon pack, and then we'll do one more Unified Minds. Go for the last shiny, and then we'll finish off the Unified Minds. If I can get this open. <laughs> All right. Here's the co card. Take four from the back. That's unfortunate. I don't know if y'all can see it. But one of the cards in the back here. We can get it to zoom to the right part, focus on the right part. Anyways, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a little bit of edge wear already on that card, so that's a little disappointing, but is what it is. And we refocus on the right spot. We've got a leaf energy. Kamala. Delmise. Which Kamala reminded me, I just picked up a ton of those. Uh, aisle packs, the ones that are by the cash register, of Burning Shadows, so I'm really excited to open that up soon. We're looking out for that Charizard. Uh, I'm hoping that'll be a really cool episode. So, one of those packs, it's the Kamala promo, so that's what it reminded me of. Look out for that soon. Crest, Leah, Fungus, Amoongus, Honage, Magnemite, Fletchling, Onyx, that's a beautiful Onyx card. Misty is my second favorite trainer, which is weird because my favorite type is water but rock is actually my first favorite trainer one i think because his name is similar to mine so growing up i think that fascinated me but two he was really into pokemon breeding 
And as you learned from the Shining Legends episode, I thought that was a really cool part of the Pokemon world. Um, I think it's cool to look at genetics. I think it'd be cool to, if you could match up different Pokemon. So like if you bred an Onix with a Manaphy, you would get like a Manaphy with Blue Tail. I don't know, it'd be weird. That's probably not the best matchup. But I've seen people who have actually done that, like they mix uh, po or Pokemon Pikachu with Charmeleon, and it was really cool looking. I wish that you could do that. Hopefully, maybe one day Pokemon will introduce that to the world, but it's kind of like animal species where you can't really breed a dog with a hamster, so is what it is. Um, makes sense. All right, our verse Hollow Hoot Hoot with Zapdos in the background. These cards are just beautiful. I, I, I'm a, amazed. And our rare is a Tapu Fini, regular rare. I'm disappointed, but it's all right. All right, let's get the shiny Denisect pack out of the way. I can get it open. But while I'm opening this, let me know in your comments if you have found hidden fates and let me know all the shiny Pokemon you're getting, your favorite Pokemon, and any of you have hit that $400 Charizard, let me know. That'd be incredibly cool to know. Uh, and I can kind of congratulate you. Um, one, for just finding it because I can't find it. Uh, the first Walmart I went to, there was evidence that it was once there. There was a box with nothing in it, but at least there was the box that showed that once upon a time it was on the shelves. I went back, box disappeared, I went on the website, it says completely out of stock. There's rumors going around that there was an entire shipment that got um, sent to a different country. I don't know if it's true, but it's it seems like it is because it's nowhere near me. So uh, maybe I just got the bad luck, but the tins are coming out, so hopefully I'll get the tins and I can put it on the channel. Uh, I'm excited about that because I really want to see these cards in person. I've seen them in videos that people are pulling, and they're beautiful. I've been waiting for the set forever. I feel like everyone has, um, but it's been absolutely beautiful. Sorry, I was looking down because the code card was bent, and I want to make sure that none of the cards are. It doesn't look like it, but here is the code card. Um, so let me know if you've even got your hands on Hidden Faith, and I'll congratulate you, but I'll definitely congratulate you if you got the Charizard, because, uh, I, I've seen people open thousands of packs, and I've probably only seen, like, four or five amongst different people, like, not one person getting four or five, but, uh, it's ridiculous. The pull rate is insane. Um, so I'm excited to go searching for that Charizard, and if you have found it, let me know, uh, because that's incredible. All right. We have a Steel Energy, Double Colorless Energy, which is always great when you're playing Pokemon. Switch, Venusaur, Thunfisk, Totodile, Litten, Purloin, Voltorb, Reverse Hollow Ivysaur, and a Hollow Verizian, which if you watch our Shining Legends uh, channel, we already got this one, but I will sleeve it up and I'll put it over there because um, it's still a pretty card. Uh, so, so far, we have gotten the Hollow Verizion, Verizon, the Hollow Hoopa, the Hollow uh, Steel, Hollow Latios, and the Hollow Manaphy over here in our Hollow Party. And in our Ultra Rare Family, Cherish Ball got a special invite because it is a really awesome card. So, Cherish Ball got to be a part of the family, even though it's not an Ultra Rare, it's not even a Rare. But it got to be a part of it. Mawile GX and our tag team Mega Sableye and Tyranitar. I'm not sure which one I like better. Uh, right now, I think I'm leaning towards the Mawile. I know that's kind of like anti what most people would because this is a tag team, but it's just a beautiful card. So I think I might go with the Mawile. As far as those, I think my favorite out of three might be the Cherish Ball just because it's such a good card. Um, Let's move on to Mewtwo and Mew. Let me know which which one's your favorite out of the Ultra Rare family. Mawile, Tyranitar, Sableye, or the Cherish Ball. Are you like me and pick the non-Ultra Rare as your favorite? Or do you like the tag team? Alright, here's the code card for Unified Minds. Let's see what kind of luck we have, what kind of pack magic we have. We have three more after this, so hopefully we've got something good. And here we go. We've got Fairy. I think I may have seen something, so... Sorry if that spoiled it for you guys and you saw it too. Uh, Taurus with a ton of lightning. It looks really intense. Munchlass. 
Lax, which is one of my favorites. He looks extremely hungry. Magneton, oh, that's really cool how you can kind of see it looks like they're breaking the sound barrier. Uh, Pit of, which is a unique artwork. These are just so beautiful. Uh, Poipool, Numel, Axu, Finion, Verse Hollow, Tornadus, and Heat Ran GX. Uh, it's a gorgeous card. It might even be better to me than Mawile. I don't know as far as the pricing. I don't know which one's more expensive, but it, as far as beauty, I'm digging the Heat Ran. I don't know if it beats Cherish Ball, but I'm digging it. So it's going to get a sleeve and it is going to join our ultra rare family over here on the left. If I can get it all the way in the sleeve. These guys just don't want to be boxed up. They don't want limits. They don't want to sleep. They want to live freely. All right, so Heat Ran GX has joined our ultra rare family of Cherish Ball who got a special invitation. Heat Ran GX, Mawile and Mega Sableye and Tyranitor GX. All right, moving on to our third to last pack. It's a Garchomp pack, and let's go. All right, here's the code card. Once again, let me know if you get anything cool out of those. Um, I'd really like to know. And here we go, Lightning, Caracosta. I've never seen that. Oh, it's the one, okay. I really dig these Pokemon. The uh, blue turtle looking ones. Really, I'm in love. Great potion. Five. Five. Sorry. Struggling Marini. Litwick. Cubone. Yanma. Young Goose. Reverse Hollow. Lickitung. And a non hollow rare of Lucario, Grantia, Garantina, and Garchomp in the background. So it actually is a really cool card. I just wish it was hollow. But um, it's still beautiful. So I'll take it. All right, second to last pack, we've got Espeon and Deoxys. Hopefully that means we're gonna get the Espeon and Deoxys. Uh, let's see, I mean, I'll take the Mewtwo as well. I'm, I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna be upset about it. So let's see what we get here. All right, here's the code card. I've been pulling it out of the pack off the camera just so you don't see the back of the code card because I hate when it, uh, when it spoils it for you. I guess it's upside down. Give me one second. My dog is barking at me. Maybe she knows that this is a good pack. She's letting us know something great is coming. Yes? All right, now that Naomi has been satisfied, I'm not sure what she wanted, but I guess she just wanted out of the room, so I let her out. Let's get into this pack and see if she was right that something amazing is happening. I'm sad that she's gonna miss it because she wanted to leave the room, but let's see four cards from the back. We've got Steel Energy, Type Null, Pokemaniac, Lapras, a beautiful card, Pit of, Muna, Pikachu, Lickitung, Purloin, our Licky Licky Reverse Hollow, which is funny because it goes with the Lickitung Reverse Hollow, and an Aerodactyl GX, which is amazing, one of my favorite cards. So I guess she was right, something beautiful was about to come. It's not the Mewtwo and the Mew, but it's still amazing. So I'm going to sleeve it up. And it is going to join our ultra rare family on the left there. I think this has been a great episode. We have one pack left. I wish there was more. But this is all we've got. Um, so let's put that in there. Let's show you again our ultra rare family. Cherish Ball who got the special invite. It must be a very, very important VIP. An Aerodactyl GX. A Heat Ran GX. A Mawile GX and our Mega Sableye Tarantor GX tag team. So let's put them all over here. And then our Hollow Party to the right, still pretty cool, but just not as ultra rare. We have Verizian Verizon, Hoopa Hollow, uh, Steel Energy, Lactios, and Manafi. Let's put them all over here on the right. Let's get to our last pack. Let's get some last pack magic up in here. Like this video subscribe to the channel make sure to go back a video and subscribe and like so that you can get that giveaway make sure to answer the question otherwise you won't be entered into the giveaway tell your friends because we need up to 10 people but like subscribe do whatever you have to do cross everything to give us a blast pack magic because i'm hoping there's something amazing and brilliant in here otherwise 
It doesn't matter, we've got this entire ultra rare party over here. We've checked one of the cards off of our list. So it really doesn't matter, but I, I, if we can get the Mio of YouTube, I will, I will flip out. I will leave this room, and that'll be the end of the video. Otherwise, it's still the end of the video. And I'll see you next time, and it's most likely going to be Burning Shadows, and we are going to be looking for that Charizard. All right, my voice is going out, so let's open this pack. Uh, and I, hopefully you did whatever you had to do to give us last pack magic, because I'm hoping there's something good in here. All right, let me open it. All right, I've already ripped it, so let's, uh, let's rip it. All right. Here's the code card. Let's see. And if nothing happens, thank you for trying to do the last pack magic. Anyway, I really enjoy it. Remember, you are loved and accepted on this channel. The Pokemon community is an incredible community. So I want you to know that what, no matter who you are, whatever age you are, whatever gender, you are accepted here. Thank you so much for coming. And you are definitely loved, no matter who you are, no matter what you've been through. You are loved. And you have a purpose and believe in that. Alright, let's go. We've got water, which is my favorite. We've got Yokomuku, Vigroth, Unidentified Fossil, Rylu with a beautiful sunset on this Sunday, Sunny Day, Purloin, Joltik. That's actually a really cool card. I don't usually like Joltik, but that's amazing. Dratini getting the whirlpool around, which makes me actually reminds me right now, if y'all don't mind. Thoughts and prayers to anyone who's been uh, affected by the Hurricane Dorian. It's it's uh, it's just keeps growing, and um, it's beyond my ability to understand why things like this happen. But I do pray, and I do uh, hope and want to do whatever I can to help them. If something comes up to where I can have, uh, let me know. Uh, if there's anything y'all are a part of that can maybe help people directly help them. Um, let me know and I can attach it to my Instagram or this video or whatever because it's devastating when stuff like this happens. Uh, I'm not going to continue to go on about it because I could go on all day about uh, how much it sucks, but you know, keep your prayer, uh, keep them, keep the people affected in your prayers. Um, and if you are affected, let me know so I can pray for you and your family and let me know if there's anything I can do for you directly. Um, I don't have much, but I'll try my best because uh, that's the kind of person I want to be. I want y'all to know that you're loved, but I also want to do whatever I can to help you because I think that's how we make the world better. All right, here we go. Dratini in the middle of a hurricane, out, uh, putting all his positive energy out to you guys, but also keeping the people affected by the hurricane in his thought. Young Goose, the reverse hollow care across the end. We got the regular rare. Licky licky. Alright, that's unfortunate, but we've still had an amazing video. So let's bring these guys down here to let you see in our hollow party. We have Verizian Verizon, a hollow Hoopa, which I still really love this card, uh, hollow Steel Energy, a Lactios, and a Manafi. And then we have in our ultra rare family Cherish Ball. We got a special ticket to the party because it's not even a rare. Aerodactyl GX, which is a beautiful card. Heat Ran GX, Mawile GX, and our tag team, the one and only tag team of this episode, Mega Sableye and Tyranitar GX. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Do not forget to go back an episode and get the giveaway for this binder, this very one right here. All these wonderful pages in there to put all your cards. And the Alolan Ninetales and Lycanroc on the back. It is a great binder. I really want to give it away. I want someone to have this binder in their collection. So if you want this or you need this in your collection, make sure to go back and video, like the video, subscribe to the channel, tell all your friends to do the same thing because once we have 10 people, I can draw your name and that binder, this binder can be yours. Remember to do that. Remember that you are loved and accepted on this channel, and I cannot wait to see you again, hopefully with some burning shadows. Everybody have a great day. Thank you so much for tuning in here to Unboxing Brook. Alright, Unboxing Brook community, this is actually kind of exciting. I'm back for a bonus round because I forgot that I put these two packs to the side. These were the ones where the card box was straight edged instead of cut to a corner. 
or cut to, you know, like, instead of going like this, it was like that, uh, which is a new thing with Unified Minds. But this one, these two had straight edges instead. So I put them to the side to see if it made a difference, and I totally forgot about them. So we're going to open them right now. First one is Garchomp and Giratina. Hopefully we have some bonus pack magic because I'm excited because I thought that we were all done and we are not. We actually have these two left. So let's get into it. All right. Sorry, I got to take a breath because I was super excited. All right. Okay, code card is facing away. So I don't even know what color it is. Here's the code card. Hopefully that's in focus enough for you to see it. All right, let's get to it. I'm super pumped all right we have a green leaf energy we have kamala pokemon research lab see i don't even have the parties out because i put them all away because i thought we were done we have the pokemon research lab which looks really cool we have lumineon meditite who is doing some meditation yoga noibat Swa swaddle scropey which has a space like background that's really cool wimpod that's a really cool artwork Okay, sorry. Reset Stamp, which is also a really good card, and Salazzle Regular Rare, but still, guys, I was, this is still exciting. I don't care, I don't even care that it's not an ultra rare. It's like Christmas Day when you thought all the gifts were gone, but there was another one in the corner, um, titled Santa, to, uh, from Santa to Brooke, Unboxing Brooke. So, here we go. Last one, Espeon and Darkrai. Let's see if they have some last pack magic. Let's get into it. All right. I <laughs> got get it open. All right. No. Okay. Again, we can't see the code, whether it's green or not. So there is the code card. Hopefully you get something great out of it. Let me know. Here's the little four. And this is the final last, last, last pack magic. Also a bonus round. Let's see what we got. Fighting energy. Giant Hurt. These are cool because these are cards I haven't gotten. Figure off. Aldino. Again, a card I haven't gotten. And, uh, I forgot what the game was called, but the one where you, it's kind of like Pokemon Puzzle League where you play on your phone. I use Aldino all the time to make evolution to beat Pokemon on that. Um, I'm spacing on it. Okay, Cottony. It's another crochet Pokemon! Sorry. I'm so excited because they were extra packed. Snow Rod, Dynamo, the meditating meditate yoga meditating meditate yoga reverse hollow we already got one and a regular rare gum shoes but it, i don't have gum shoes i don't have the salazzle so it's cool we can add it to the collection i know that was a lot of excitement for just regular rares but it was still really cool to see that i had two packs left um and i don't know if it actually made a difference i wish it kind of was ultra rare so i can say yeah it made a difference but I guess it really didn't, um, but they were, so these are common cards, but they are more uncommon to me because I haven't gotten them yet. So that was cool, but I hope you all enjoyed it. I'm sorry that I was super pumped about it, but I was. Um, I wish we had gotten better pulls out of it, but it's still really cool to have a bonus round that you had no idea was coming. I hope you all have a great day, just like I'm having a lazy Sunday or a great Sunday, energized Sunday. My lazy slack off Sunday just turned into an energized Sunday. But I wish we'd gotten better cards, but it doesn't matter. All of you guys, I love you all. You're all amazing people. I can't wait to see you next episode.